Shalom family. So this article is cool. Yeah, you know, there was a time we were joking about all this in 2022, I think, when they were like, yeah, no, we discovered some mummies or a hidden tomb in Egypt. We're going to open it up and everyone would make memes and things about, don't open it. It's 2022. You know, what the heck? This is not the time for that. Put it back. It is hilarious. Archaeologists found the ruins of the famous back door to hell. Yeah, you heard me correctly. Project Laoba, probably gutting the word, created a 3D model of a system of caves and passageways known as the back door to hell in southern Mexico. The ancient Zapotecs believed the subterranean site to be an entrance to the underworld. The location under a church matches local law of where the entrance was all along. Now, I'm going to give you a second. You tell me what church that was. Who's behind this church? Nailed it. Yeah, you guys would be great on a game show. All you need to do to find the back door to hell is search underneath what is known as the ancient church group site. Long thought to be nothing more than local legend, it is now proven correct. Project Leoba research team discovered the system of caves and passageways believed to be the hellish entrance at the Temple of Leoba in the southern Mexican state of Oaxaca in the famed Mitla ruins. In 1674, Francisca de Bourgeois, a 17th century Dominican chronicler, gave an account of exploring subterranean temples containing four interconnected chambers with Spanish missionaries. They found tombs of priests and kings. They came the most intriguing, a stone door that led to a cavern as deep as, wait for it, 90 miles. Yeah, not sure how that is possible either, but into the earth and complete with intersecting passages and a pillar supported roof that goes down. Fearing that this was literally the back door to hell, the missionaries reportedly had the underground labyrinth sealed off. And then what better to do but to build a Catholic church on top of it. And where's the entrance? Underneath the main altar of the Catholic church. Epically on point. Pope Francis approves this message. That was the right place to put it. The team found the large void under the altar that connected with additional geophysical anomalies to the north of the church. At least for the time being, there's no plan to dive deep and physically explore the back door to hell. Why not? Send me. I volunteer. Pay for my flight. Get me there. I'll go down. I'm not scared. I've got Jesus with me. Happily, I'll take my son We'll go down and go and explore. Give me the equipment. I'll head straight down there with my Bible. No worries. I find it extremely interesting. But really, 2024, the year of the dragon, right before April 8 eclipse over America, right before all of these signs are seemingly coming together, right before this Middle East conflagration that's taking place, the New World Order rising, and everything else seemingly being in place. And Pope Francis, a very strong candidate for the false prophet, the head of the Catholic Church, who under their altar has the gateway to hell. I'll check it out. God bless. Keep looking up. Shalom.